Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am here with a very teeny tiny haul. There are two purchases and one gift. So I'm gonna do the gift first. I tell you, it's been a very quiet post week. Very quiet indeed. So, um, a lovely lady reached out to me on Instagram and asked if she could send me some clips. She was opening a planner clip store and asked if she could send me some. So she included this postcard, which is really pretty. Um, her name is Katie and I will link her Instagram down below. So she sent me some planner jewellery and some palm clips which she said I can share with the kids or keep for myself. And I'll admit I'm probably going to allow Posey to have some. <laughs> I don't really have a huge choice. But there are three sets of palm clips which I love. How cute are they? And they're so soft. And they're not like the solid pom-poms, you know, that you get the really hard solid ones. These are softer, which I actually like. They feel like squishy. Like I don't feel like this is going to fall out and bash me. <laughs> that makes sense. But I really love these. I love the colours that she chose for me. So very excited about those. I might let Posy have one. Maybe she could have the baby one and I could have the big one. Love the packaging as well, that's really cute. And then some planner jewellery, which she said in her note is Disney themed planner jewellery, which, eek. Okay, so there is a palm clip. A white palm clip, they all go together and this is perfect. Okay, so there's Cinderella clip with blue beads and silver hardware. And then a charm with the Cinderella shoe. So these all coordinate because the Cinderella with the blue and the white. And these are perfect because I have set up my A5 wide in like a Disney theme. And I don't actually have any clips or planner charms on or anything. So these are going to go perfectly in there. So thank you so much, Katie. So as I said, these were sent to me for free um, with no obligation to share or anything like that, but I wanted to because they're lovely and it was a really nice gift. So thank you very much. Okay, I have got two orders to share with you today. I feel like I should have more. Hold on. Okay, make that three because I forgot about this one that arrived earlier in the week. So, um, this is an order from Fantasy Design Stores. We're going to do this one first because why not? This one arrived first in the week. <laughs> So this one I ordered, oh, oh, it's on the back, on the 12th of May, and I love the thank you postcard. I actually already have two of these, do I have two or do I have two, and I framed them both. One of them's up in my office, and Posey's got the other one, so I'm going to use this one to make a dashboard in my... A5 wide. So what I ordered was, so this I think was a freebie when you ordered at a certain, on a certain date. I'm not sure, but that's ace. Love that. And then there's this freebie. I do love that those clothes won't fold themselves. That's my life. <laughs> and then this postcard, which, oh my goodness, is so cute. So I bought this. This is the A6 Laughter Imagination Dreams journaling card. And it's plain on the other side. Ooh, it's got some of the inks rubbed off from there. That's okay. But that is gorgeous. I love that. And I wanted that for my A5 wide as well. So I got the May kit for the Aura Estelle A5 wide monthly pages. So obviously it's Star Wars themed. And I love that. So I got the full kit with functional add-on. And I also got the June. I intend on having the entire year in the Fantasy Design Stores kits. So that is the June boxes. It's beautiful. Uh, yeah, because I've already done up to, well, obviously up to June now. So I'm just going to get the whole year for the monthlies. 
And then I ordered this kit, which is the California Adventure, and I got this in the new sticker paper, which is the premium sticker paper, and it feels lovely. It feels like unicorn vinyl. I love it. And the colors, like, you can see the difference in the color. The colors just pop so much more. It's gorgeous. So I got this kit because I thought it was cute. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be ever going to California Disneyland, but you know, it's still a cute kit, even if I never go. And you can love Disney without having to go. So cute. I love the washi. I love the fireworks shaped like Mickey head. So cute. So that is my order from Fantasy Design Stores. I will leave a link to the shop down below. Next up is my order from Philo Fabulous. Now, I, I need to tell you about this. So I ordered, oh cute. I ordered this on Friday at 2 p.m. I want to say. And this arrived today on Saturday. I mean, holy moly, that's some, uh, that's some impressive turnaround. <laughs> so I ordered some date dots. Uh, Rachel over at Rachel Beauty Plans, I'll leave a link to her channel. She swears by these date dots and I like to have a variety. And all the date dots I make myself are like this, where it's the number that's foiled. But I liked how these are the circle that's filed and the number's clear. So there's a postcard and there's a freebie. All the, also the pricing on these date dots was really good. So I got this, which is like a pink crackle and the gold, oh, this is a leopard print. It doesn't show up hugely as leopard print on these numbers, but it's still cute. And I got the pink, I got the stars, I got the plain pink, I actually got all the colours she had available, so cot pink, pale pink, whatever, uh, copper, holographic rainbow, electric blue, the mint, that's the rainbow, love the rainbow one. Gold and silver. So yeah, I got those purely based off Rachel Beauty Plans, uses them a lot. And you can never have enough date dots, to be honest. And I am running a little bit low. And I fancied some. And yeah, I could not believe it when they came in a day. One day. And last up is this. This also came in a day. Can you tell that Friday was, whoa, whoa, Friday was a spend heavy day, shall we say? Oh yes, it was. It was a spend heavy day. I was having a bad day, I'm having a bad weekend, I'm having a bad week. Love Heart Sweeties, I will save for Posey because she loves them. And uh, yeah, so I might have gone a bit silly yesterday. <laughs> And it was quite nice that when I went a bit silly because of bad mental health, it came the next day. Didn't have to wait. Oh, hello. Silly, you said? I am silly, Ninja Mouse. I bought two new fountain pens and some ink. And it came today. And it came today. And my Philo Fabulous order that I ordered, which is an Etsy shop that I ordered yesterday at two o'clock, came today. That is customer service. Damn right. And she's having a sale today. I wish I'd waited till today. I Never mind. Silly as well, so it's yeah, Greg knew I was silly. Ninja Mouse doesn't really give a shit as long as the bills are paid. I don't care. Um, but he knew I was silly yesterday, yes, didn't he? I once actually knew. Yeah. Mysterious parcels arriving. <laughs> he really doesn't care. It's the only reason I play magic is so I've got new pop. I get mail. Because <laughs> oh, he's jealous of my mail. <laughs> my mail like, My mail comes from all over Europe. On the... uh, mine, yeah, mine comes. From, no, mine doesn't. No, see, look, I'm more diverse. But look, this one's got a narwhal. It's called narwhal. Uh, well, I'm impressed. It's a narwhal pen. <laughs> okay, he's supposed to be getting posy to sleep. No idea why he's out here. She she giving up. No, no, she no, broke no, you no, already. No, no, no. Okay, I have to just. She broke him already at half past seven. We're in trouble. 
Okay. <laughs> so yeah, I was silly and it came today and now we're gonna open it. I will admit <laughs> I wasn't as silly as I could have been. Um, so I was actually, I went on looking at ink and I saw these Mont Blanc inks, okay? So there's this one, which is the Petrol Blue, which is their color of the year. And there's a set of three inks and I was like, ooh, this one costs 30 pounds, but it's a huge bottle, a 50 ml bottle. And I was like, ooh, how much is the other one? Yeah, the other 30, are they 50 ml bottles? I can't remember, were 60 pounds a pop. So I was like, yeah, maybe not. So I did get this one. Wow, that is a pretty bottle. And oh, it's quite funny. So my brother is also fountain pen obsessed. We discovered over lockdown that we share that um, passion. And <laughs> I told him, he told me there was a sale at Cult Pens for their birthday. And I went and looked and I just clicked fountain pens. And I said to him, the first one that came up, I was like, oh, that's gorgeous. It's a beautiful color. It looks really nice. And then I was like, yeah, no, not getting that though. It was from Mont Blanc and it cost like a hundred, no, it cost like a 800 and something pounds. And I was like, yeah, no. <laughs> so don't worry, I haven't been that silly. I've just been this silly. Look at that. Oh my God. Okay, I'm really quite excited about this. So. I did get this one, which is the color of the year. Like I say, the petrol blue. Gorgeous, love the box. And my brother actually sent me a link to an Etsy seller who sells samples of inks. So I think I'm gonna get some samples of the other ones because, I mean, I was silly, but I wasn't that silly. <laughs> so I got two pens, a Twisby and a Narwhal. So I'm gonna open the Twisby first because I already have Twisbys, so this isn't new for me. <laughs> So I got this, which is the Twisby Eco Fountain Pen in Transparent Purple. So I already have the Transparent Mint, I think it is. Yeah, I have the Mint. And I decided I wanted this one. If I can get into it. Ooh. Okay. This is pretty. I think I might put the, the petrol blue ink in here. Oh, I mean, I should put purple. I've never matched very well. So, look at that. It's so pretty. So the lid is that beautiful transparent purple. And so is the other end. And it has a silver nib, which I got in the extra fine. I like my pens to be scratchy. That is really nice. I don't actually think I do have any other transparent ones. Just looking at them all, none of them are like this one. That is really pretty. I'm really excited about that. And then while browsing, because that's what you do, I found this brand, which I've never had before, which is Narwhal. I love Narwhals, love them. And it was because on the first page, Cult Pens had a, <clears throat> Um, cult pen exclusive, which I was gonna get that one originally, but then I saw this one and thought no I think I prefer this one. So this is the Narwhal Shayul Kill in Marlin Blue in fine Ooh, I'm liking it so far Okay Oh, oh can't get it out of the bag. The bag is stuck it is stuck in the back. The bag appears to be stuck. Here we go. There we go. Oh, wow. I love that. Okay. Can you see how it looks like the ocean? Okay, maybe I should put the petrol blue in here. Oh my goodness, I really like that. I should probably put the petrol blue in here because it's a blue pen. So it comes with the user guide and warranty. Okay, so it literally tells you how to use it, how to fill it with ink and your warranty card. So 
I am quite excited about these new pens. The colours are gorgeous. And yeah, this is what happens when Caroline has a silly moment and goes on cult pens. I blame my brother for these purchases, if I'm honest. <laughs> So that's actually it. That's all I've got to show you today. So not a huge haul, an expensive one. It's an expensive one, but not huge. Oh, this one matches my nails as well. Okay, we might have to go with this one. Um, I will swatch the ink and I'll leave a little bit of footage right here with that. Okay, I've put the ink in my Twisby because my narwhal, when I went to fill it, so you're supposed to just twist that end slightly till you feel resistance. I did that and the whole thing fell off. So I'm going to be getting in touch with cult pens about that one. So I put the ink in my Twisby. So this is my um, swatch page in my Stalogy reference book. So. Ooh, oh, I like it. Mont Blanc. Petrol. Blue. Oh, that's really nice. You see that? That's really pretty. It's definitely petrol blue. And I very much like it. I think I'm going to put that. At the moment, I've got... Um, two fountain pens sitting beside me. One of them has got Monteverdi Rose Pink and the other one's got Black Ash. I think I'm going to put this there as well to use this month because that is really pretty. I love that and the pen feels really nice as well. Gorgeous. So that's us. So I will leave links down below if anybody has any questions. Please ask them down below or you can find me on Instagram. Put my Instagram name just here. You can also find me in my Facebook group. The link for that will be down below. If you request to join, please answer all three joining questions because that's how I weed out the bots. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching and I will speak to you all soon. Bye. Bye.